guys welcome to another video how are you guys doing if you're new hey do not forget to smash that subscribe button and if you're a new subscriber mwah, thank you so much for coming back i really really appreciate it okay so i'm super excited because i think i can officially say that after buying all these books okay all these I'm going on a book buying ban for a while okay <laughs> guys okay so I'm gonna explain these are supposed to be my birthday present to myself and my birthday is September 2nd but I'm filming this video Ju August August 21st so we're close we're close my birthday is next week so we're close okay so happy birthday to me my present so I'm gonna be doing a book haul and these are all the books I got oh my god i think i should take a thumbnail first because i'm sure i cannot carry all these jesus let me show you everything oh can you see okay can you see i have i have this box here Go and series always scaring the shit out of me i have this box here and i have this box here they are from two different vendors okay <laughs> siri here let me know if i can help no you cannot help who is the child that's crying? Oh, guys, I didn't even talk about the elephant in the room. The elephant in the room. You guys, my bookshelf. Yeah. <laughs> I am going to fill it up. Like, look at this. So, that is how high it is. And it comes down like this to this part. I have Akata behind me. And yeah. So, I'm excited actually. Oh my god, I need to set the camera right okay so i'm going to be starting with this this box okay these are the books i got from roving heights on instagram like this is like my third time or second time i don't even know buying from them and also it's a stockpile i already unboxed them for for insta oh my god my battery is low what did i do the first book here is Cinderella is Dead by Kaylin Bayron. This is a fantasy book and I've not read if any fantasy yet except Shatter Me which I don't even know if it's really fantasy or dystopian because people say it's dystopian but I don't know. I, I, I feel like the world is different from ours so probably it's also fantasy, yeah? Ooh, it says it's 200 years since Cinderella found her prince but the fairy tale is over. So I can't wait to get to it but I really like the cover. Look at the cover, you guys she looks like she has been through a lot but she's still really really beautiful i love that oh oh my god oh my god okay this is the god of good looks by brini McIvor. my friend read this book my friend kenny she posted it on uh, instagram and i was like wow this book looks so gorgeous then ore got the book and then i was like okay no 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 i got to I have to get this book too you know it's so cute like it's so beautiful immediately like this is love at first sight she told me it's by a caribbean author the author is caribbean i have no idea but when i checked on uh youtube on google google said it's a contemporary romance or so kind of book so yeah i can't wait to get into it but it's so let's just get into the cover like like just, like I, i'm thinking about recreating this look but that's when I have time for makeup. A love of convenience. Two desires, one solution, and an unexpected love affair. It's by Adesua Oman Wokedi. This particular writer, um, she has written some other books, and I think it's like a series. And I'm not ready to actually get into any series or buy any series right now because I still have a lot of series I have not. Did I just say series? I still have a lot of series I have not gotten into. So I was like, okay, let me get this one that is a standalone. Is your ma is finally marrying Dil Dili? The man she has loved almost all her life, except it's not a real marriage, but an arranged one for him to get a green card. It all seems straightforward, except for the fact that Isioma is still head over heels in love with him, while his heart is with his fiance back home in Nigeria. It's a recipe for disaster, or is it? When a book says, or oh, is it, you should know that it's about to go down. The three of us. Ore read this book also and she was like, okay, it's actually really nice. It's a very, very short book actually. It's less than 200 pages. She said the characters will piss you off. Yeah, it's 181 pages. So 
she said the characters will piss you off but you love the book so i want to get into to it too it's also a nigerian i think it's a nigerian author my killer vacation by tessa bailey guys <laughs> i have now two books by tessa bailey that i've not read then this is going to join it and i still have another one in this box here that's gonna join to it add to it that i've not read and i'm still adding to the pile okay i do not come to you by chance by adao betricia Bani. i have read a book by this author that has been in the baobab tree and that book was about this during the chibok girls time they kidnapped the boko haram and all that so i've tasted this girl's writing and i liked it it was very easy to get through but still very deep so when kenny bought this one i was like okay let me get it too so i added it to my pile and we are we are body reading it today as long as the lemon trees grow by zulfa katuf it has a very high rating on goodreads that was why i got it tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow by gabriel zeden zeven zeven this book has been everywhere i'm not going to lie to you that it's not because of tiktok it's because of book talk booktube booktube that i bought it okay but the cover is different from this one and i feel like I want that cover so if i still can lay my hands on that cover i'll get it because yeah this one is cute with the water waves but why is this dog barking it talks about two people that play games and their reality is the game i think and people say this book is very good so let's see at this point you guys already know colin uva is there every time i'll buy a, i'll have a haul that colin uva's book will not be there I don't think so but this is too late by colin uva because it's a thriller yeah verity is still up there that i've not read but i want to get to it it's colin uva i'm sure i'll love it why dog why human beings are trying to survive sarah adams practice makes perfect i know that this is the book too i'm supposed to read when in rome first then read this but i've not laid my hands on when in rome so i just decided to buy this and funniest thing is ori also bought it now ori has read it and she said the book is like <laughs> for her so i'm like huh but but other people like it for example i forgot their names the useful people i watch practice makes perfect but you can't fake true chemistry okay of course i have to up on the bandwagon again and i got these two things we never got over and things we hide from the light by lucy skull this one says he's absolutely not falling for the good girl and this one says good guys don't fall for bad girls ah uh, i think this is the book one this is the book two the book three is coming up soon it's purple so it's gonna fit this aesthetic of lucy skull i've not read any book by lucy skull but this one is chunky it's chunky and this one is not too chunky but chunky too scythe by neil shush 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 starman i spelled that but i'm sorry <laughs> sorry <laughs> so scythe then the toll and thunderhead i have no idea but uh it says thou shalt kill what if death was the only thing left to control in a perfect world, the only way to die is to be gleaned by a professional scythe. Ah, oh, so it's only them that can kill. Okay. However, the ter terrifying responsibility of choosing their victim is just the start. Oh, my, 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 my. I actually saw, yeah, I just remembered I saw someone post this on Instagram and you know, this, uh, this series, they're my favorite. Yeah. So I, I can't wait to actually get into it. It's a fantasy and it's looking like it's going to be like the same vibe as fantasy is a genre of speculative fiction involving magical elements typically set in a fictional universe and usually inspired by mythology or folklore would you like to hear more no thank you i saw tokyo dreaming by emiko jean and i have tokyo tokyo ever after over there so i was actually searching for this because this is the book two of that one and i've not even read the book one yeah but i could not find the ad back so and I didn't even like the ad back, to be quite honest. The color was green. I got The Vanishing Elf by Brit Benes. Oh my god, let's get into this cover, guys. The cover is so cute. It talks about two sisters. Yes, that's why I got it. I read the review where the person said it talks about two identical twins. Uh, and uh, They are identical twins. And something happens that the other sister is probably dying. And I'm like, mm. 
I want I want twins for the love of God I want to give birth to twins so let me know in the comment section if you also love twins identical okay I must give birth to identical twins but don't hold me to that it's not like I can control it you know it's God that giveth God giveth but you access right <laughs> Chloe Gong's foul lady fortune I had no idea this book was gonna be Wow. I wanted to swat the fly, but the door is open, so the flies are just anyway. I mean the wild encyclopedia of fairies. This is so cute. Like you can uh, fantasies just have the most beautiful covers ever. Let's see what's under the dust jacket. Nothing. Do they at least have joints of fairies or something? No. So that's the end of that. That's all I got from Roving Eye. So I'm going to put this back in the box. I can't get over this beauty. I can't get over it. Oh. Right. It's actually tripped over at night. I don't know where this sense came from for me to just stack it on each other like this. But guys, I'm excited. I got fourth wing. I got fourth wing. But let's calm down. Okay, so these ones are from Novel's Books Collection on Instagram. I always buy a lot of books. And these are about 44 books or something. I don't know. We're going to count it. No, we cannot count. We might count it at the end of the video. On this side, I have the thrifted books. On the other side, I have the new ones. So let me th show you the thrifted books ones first the long way to a small angry planet by becky chambers and gone girl by gillian flynn these ones are gifts from her she sent me these as presents and i'm so 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 grateful for that like thank you girl thank you so much and it's not even my birthday present she's still going to send my birthday present she's gonna send me my birthday present right i got switched by amanda Hawkins. wow so a mother accused her of being switched at birth and I think she has some powers. Eleanor Oliphant is completely fine. I got this because of one book, star, book YouTuber that I saw. I forgot her name, but she said this is the best book she has ever read in her life. It's talking about this lady, Eleanor Oliphant, that, and how she's dealing with life. But the cover was different, but I love, love the matchstick design here i got a lot of thrillers the family upstairs by lisa jules this is going to be the first lisa jules book i will ever own the girl on the train by paula hawkins <laughs> sophie kinsella oh my god at this point i have almost all the books sophie kinsella ever wrote and i've only read one confession of a shopaholic i owe you one i've got your number this is so cute i like this cover these are my sophie kinsella books i have one two three four five six six sophie kinsella books plus this seven eight nine now nine and i've only read one five years from now it's about two people but that they separate then they come back together five years later i don't know what happens but yeah it's by page tune sweet freak by sophie mckenzie the mixtape by jane sanderson the mountain between us this has a movie cover. I, I don't know how I feel about real people on covers, but these people are actually really cute. They look good together. So I think it's about them crossing all the boundaries between them to be together. Maybe. This secretary. She knows all your secrets, but will she keep them? Oh my god. Let's read it. Christine is a hard-working assistant devoted to the woman she serves. She's loyal and discreet and invisible presence who are, who hears everything a silent witness to whispered secrets the trusted one but there is a fine line between loyalty and betrayal and when someone like christine is pushed to the edge she might just become the most dangerous person in the room okay poison princess it's i think it's like a fantasy but behind it there's this guy here this is a thrifted book you guys a thrifted book and it looks this neat why is the cover glued then i saw a video where patience was reading the vendor herself was reading this poem and some of the words were actually really nice so i decided to add it to it it's a poetry collection there are different poet poems who am i saying there are different poems inside it and i was like okay i would love to actually read this on my asmr channel i saw these two i just wanted to get into thriller and you know it's september and october so yeah the man who died twice and the Thursday Mother Club by Richard Osman, blue and red covers. The Night Circus by Erin Morgan Stern. 
no idea what it's about but i've seen it everywhere too little fires everywhere oh my god this book people say it's very emotional so i want to get into it actually me before you by jojo moise and after you so this is the last one among the thrifted books this is going to hurt by adam k i heard it's a series so i want to get into it i just want to read something different something other than romance that's why i went crazy on all these thrillers so let the camera cool down okay guys so um i have just about eight minutes to show you guys the new ones but before that i saw these in my package these bookmarks and now i have a lot of these exact bookmarks because she gave me the last time too then she also gave me this really really cute kitty cat note pad i've never seen before and i don't know how it works this came in also by the same uh printing press i think masobe yeah masobe my nigerian room to make my stories magical i have this ex something like this also and i have read some of these books also and i just got some of these books also so i got the art back of it ends with us this special edition look at it guys this is why i got it i have the other one no. I have the other one, the paperback, but I wanted to get this. It's so cute. I just could not ignore. I've not read the story, but I love the cover. On that just jacket, you have this. It's just so cute. It's kind of rare to find special editions here. Tomorrow I become a woman. I picked this because I like this cover better than the other cover. You can see the woman here, here. But the other cover looked a little bit like an artwork and it was a little creepy to me but i like this one that's why i got it oh, oh i got popping and not spread edges of course <laughs> but i plan to spread the edges myself it's gonna be a little book ex experiment maybe i'm gonna try but we all know it's fantasy everybody has talked about it everybody raves about this on the internet so i'm like yes i must read it even though i've never read any fantasy yet but this book is gonna be my project they are dragons. They can go to dragon school. Why not? Better than the movies by Lim Painter. I've been wanting, wanting to get a Lim Painter book. And so here it is. I think I will even read this ASAP because I just want to read it. It's, people say it's that good. Got Kiana, the girl who fell beneath the sea. Mainly because of the cover. To be honest, because of the cover. Don't chase faith. Let faith chase you. Wow. <laughs> Someday maybe by only one Benile Nelly. Oh god, I need to stop doing this. I am to body read this with my friends soon, but they are their own see guys their own copy is more beautiful than mine and I just placed an order for that exact copy. That is the ad back. So I'm gonna get it. I still like this, it's still cute to be honest. The Forbidden by Jody Ellen. Mild. I forgot what it's about. The one night she can't forget the temptation she can't escape. I think it's also romance and it's kind of like erotica. I don't know. I don't know. One for sorrow, two for joy. Cute cover. Yellow. <laughs> Dear Enemy by Christine Kalian. I don't I don't think I saw this anywhere. I just bought it because I I just wanted to read it. The friend zone. Oh my god, the friend zone by Abby Imenez. The happy ever after playlist. I have that up there. So this the friend zone. And there's another one also by Abby Imenez. I got. But I'll find it somewhere here. Then I got the cheese sheet by Sarah Adams. People say this is just a very, very sweet rom com. Nothing too serious, just cheesy. Yes. Sina by Sarah Simone. I think it's also erotica or dark romance. I'm not sure. Then I got Tweet Cute. Honestly, this looks so cute. <laughs> it looks like it's just a sweet rom-com that you can read to be happy with your life. Then it happened one summer by Tessa Bailey. Finally, I have the book one, two, hook, line, and sinker. Finally. I was going to be pissed off if they don't match, but wait. The hook, line, and sinker is a little bit taller than just a little bit just a little bit but it's not that crazy then i have praise by sarah kate i saw um <laughs> what's this girl's name again god i forgot what's her name she was reading this it's a dark romance maybe i don't know then i got i got the complete series for the chestnut spring oh my god chestnut spring series so this is 
Reckless by Elsa Siva. Silva. Oh my god, what's up? Powerless. Fearless. Then Heartless. Sorry, flawless. Let's do it again. Flawless, heartless, powerless, reckless. Yes, I think there's another one coming up soon, the book five or so. But these are the covers I could lay my hands on. But I feel like it's still cute regardless. So I got it. Yours truly. This was what I was looking for. I have to figure out if yours truly is the same as part of your world or I'm, I'm the thing confusing me at this point. Because there's the friend zone series, there's and the last books, you guys. Ah, this fantasy, I got Sky Hunter. These are the most amazing, beautiful books I've ever seen. Look at it. I don't know if there's a dragon. Oh, the girl it's a girl that has wings. But seriously, guys, look at this. Look at the edges. Look at the edges. Both of them have the edges like this. This is crazy. And let's get under the dust jacket. Look at this. Have you seen something more beautiful like this? Please. Oh my god i like when books are like this wow it has a velvet feel i like when books under the just jacket have something else that is exciting to look at not just a blank not beautiful thing i don't know which of them is the book one but so guys thank you so much for watching this is the number of books i got for myself for my birthday thank you so much for watching tell me the ones i should get to asap asap okay and i'll see you guys in my next video deuces this should be my last book all for a while. Right? I can't wait to beautify my bookshelf. <laughs> okay. Grace, you have a class.